Let's talk about buying and selling RAM on EOS, RAM trading on EOS. I'm over here on EOSflare.io. This is an EOS block explorer, a blockchain explorer. You can check out top voters, top name bids. You can check on your account using your public key, and you can check on current transactions and more. Guys, let's click on one of these accounts for this example. You can see that EOS accounts are made of CPU, bandwidth, and memory. Now, it's in order to increase your CPU and bandwidth power on your EOS account, you need to stake more EOS. The more EOS you stake, the more you can increase your CPU and bandwidth power on your EOS account. Now, in order to increase your RAM memory, you need to buy that RAM directly from the EOS blockchain. If you head over to eos.feexplorer.io, this is a website that tracks the current EOS RAM price. The current price for EOS RAM is 0.29 eos per kilobyte of ram uh, this is a 30-day chart for the eos ram price that we're looking at and you can see that the price is fairly low now in order to buy and sell the eos ram you can go to eostoolkit.io this is a website built by generous eos i'm sorry if i'm mispronouncing that i know they're block producer candidates that i voted for anyhow if you go to this website i have it linked down below you could buy and sell ram you click under manage account buy ram and you can buy ram at the current price now in order to use this website you do need to log in using scatter scatter is a chrome extension that allows you to log into eos websites like eos toolkit and that chrome extension secures and your private and public eos keys okay uh, i'll have it linked down below if you guys want to check it out okay anyhow this is the website to do it at guys i also want you to check out eos hub this is a website status hyphen eos.io i'll have it linked down below for most of the links to all the websites that have to do with eos okay most of the websites excuse me most of the websites that have to do with eos are linked here this is a basically an aggregate of uh, the majority of the eos websites uh, you could check out eos park this is another blockchain explorer for eos uh, which shows you the current price the current uh, ram exchange price as well there's a little calculator here and uh, you could also check out the current block producer this gives you a block producer list uh, you can see the top 21 block producers are those that secure the blockchain and earn rewards okay this changes in real time and if you like you could also check out a video i have that shows you how to vote for block producers as well okay guys uh so to recap you can check the eos price the ram price over here on eos.feexplorer.io and check out the charts you can also check it out on uh, eos resource planner this is a uh, website built by eos new york that shows also the current network price and current cpu price what i don't like about this website is that it doesn't have a graph it doesn't have a chart so i'd rather check out the eos ram price over here but i'll have it linked down below anyhow and in order to buy the ram again you can go to eostoolkit.io i'll have it linked down below and click under manage account and you can easily uh, buy and sell ram using uh, the scatter extension okay and then the price is fixed and it's whatever is the, the price is in real time so that changes somehow the price is calculated by the blockchain itself if i'm not mistaken so there is no actual auction or anything that goes on it's just there's a certain set amount of overall ram per day and you can see uh, that amount up here and uh, that price that according to the demand fluctuates so uh, let's see uh, how uh, this may change because there were some complaints when the RAM price was higher about the RAM price and uh, Dan Larimer he did uh, come out and uh, uh, message uh, in the forums and uh, suggest that the EOS RAM price uh, be redistributed or the EOS RAM revenue be redistributed to the token holders that are staking EOS. Dan Larimer being the head developer for Block One that is putting out the EOS blockchain. So that's what he suggested in one of the forums. Okay, I think that's a pretty good idea. Redistributing the revenue earned from the EOS RAM uh, to all those that are staking EOS. 
Okay, it's a good idea. In order to implement that, there would have to be some voting. Uh, we know that EOS has a governance system, it has a constitution, and uh, there will be some steps. So it's interesting to see how this may play out. Again, guys, check it out. I'll have everything linked down below. And drop a comment. Give us your opinion. What do you think? Have you traded EOS before? Have you not? Are you looking into it? What do you think about Dan Larimer's suggestion about redistributing the RAM revenue to all the EOS stakeholders? Drop a comment below. It's the voice of the blockchain here. Satoshi's big cousin, cryptography's finest champagne crypto thanks for tuning in